<laughs> hey, where'd you other girls come from? <laughs> Everybody's getting along fine. I really didn't have a choice. That's what I'm telling myself. Because if the weak olds get any older, then they would really pick on the smaller ones. And I didn't want to start with two separate brooders. I only have so many grow out brooders and kennels. So until next year when I start um, hatching my own eggs, and I basically have a pre-order on hold um, until he gets his uh, coop done. I will not sell chicks less than two weeks old minimum because that first two weeks is the most important. I want to make sure they don't have no leg problems, um, no other problems that I could find, and that they're good and healthy. And the other chicks, one of the, uh, yeah, I see you. I see you poking your head out there. What I would call like a kiss peck, not to hurt them. And that lasted about 10 minutes here and there around the food, but then, let's see, and half these babies are underneath there with them laying down, so they're doing good, they're getting along, I got them just in time, so these can all grow up together, so that'll make it a lot easier on me, I mean, you never make your money back on everything you spend, Unless you're some big company, but I'm small. Starting out small, I changed the way I was going to do things. So, but aren't they cute? They sure are fast when they're little, too. Yeah, they are. Sure are fast. Watch this. <laughs> they come a running from my finger whenever I put it in there, don't you? What? 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 <laughs> Don't eat my finger. <laughs> but I am going to set the second brooder back up again only for the purpose of cleaning, which makes it easier. So I can get the other one ready, you know, get it clean, move them over, dump this one out, get it ready for the next time for when I want to clean. And I was going to layer this like that um, one YouTuber I saw, they layer it. But, I don't know. I just, I do it, I layer it a little bit. Huh. But yeah, now I have to keep two of everything in here. But they're doing good. Some of them's underneath there sleeping with the other ones. And these are all pullets I, I bought because I think I have um, three roos. So, I might be selling one of the roos when he gets older. But these, the ones I got today are all pullets. And so I think I've got pullets and then three roos on the other ones. And then all the rest that's already in the brooder out there and the ones that are older and in the run, those are all pullets. Yeah, I've been checking on them about every 20 minutes. So they're doing good. I just wanted to make sure they acclimated well. And they have. And that was one of the other ones. So, I mean, they're getting along fine. Getting along fine. <laughs> Go under there and take your nap. Go take a nap. Go take a nap, nap. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to leave them go for a while. Check back on them later. <laughs>